Hi everybody, Dave Berman with the Laughter Gym After Report. And this one oh, is really like right in the pocket. <laughs> like right in the dead center bullseye of, of what I, I want to be focusing on and, and what the Laughter Gym experience is really all about. You see, we laugh on purpose for 15 minutes and then we have a conversation about the experience. and. Somebody who has a lot of previous experience with laughter yoga has started uh, participating yesterday and, and today, her first two times, and she shared with us yesterday what she was noticing and then again today, and she, she said that she's become aware of an inner shift. And I, I asked her to say more about what that means, and she said, well, it's just that my attention is drawn inward rather than outward to the form of laughter exercises, which is kind of the central component of, of laughter yoga as an activity. And laughter gym is not laughter yoga. And this is one of the ways that it's very different. Laughter yoga, laughter exercises are a form and you don't necessarily want to be judging whether you're doing it correctly or incorrectly right or wrong but i think people often have that feeling or people sometimes wrestle with or struggle if they're new at facilitating laughter yoga sessions to think of well what exercise are we going to do next or preparing in advance a list of exercises and then not being so present during the session because they're referring to their list of what to do next rather than just being laughter, being present in the moment with the experience of the breath, which is inside, and sound. And so the exercises are forms and laughter yoga is a form of laughter as exercise, whereas laughter gym Laughing as the sound of joyful breathing is formless. Form and formless. And this is a huge thing to discover in a, in a spiritual sense too. And I'm not saying that laughter yoga is not spiritual or doesn't have the opportunity inherent within it for spiritual insight. I certainly got a lot from exploring laughter in that way and then now I've moved on and I'm exploring laughter in a formless way that I feel is pointing us all inward much more with the invitation being to just notice. Just notice what's already there like your laughter, for example, is something that's been there your entire life and it always will be there. Babies around the world are born with this gift of laughter and they, they exhibit laughter before they can learn to speak and before they can intellectually make sense of what's funny. So laughter is innate, it's a birthright. And when we explore it in that context and just notice what else is already there within us. I mean, we can look outside and see how babies demonstrate things like spontaneity and authenticity and creativity, resilience. There are many other birthrights that are on display when we watch children. And then we can discover that all of these gifts are still available within us unconditionally in unlimited quantities, always. <laughs> and there's many ways that you could become aware of these gifts being always available to you. And I just find that it's very pleasurable and fun and good for our health to just use our breath and sound to look within and notice these gifts. They're always there. And so we look within to see what's there to be seen. 
So you can join us in the laughter gym any day or every day. I'll put the link in the comments below. And if you'd like to discover what else you have innately available to you that can make a real difference in your experience of life, especially if you're struggling with things like stress or anxiety or panic attacks or fear or just discomfort with uncertainty, which the world is full of. If you'd like to have more creativity showing up in your life, more of a sense of connection with other people or with yourself, you can join us in the laughter gym or you might want to explore a more uh, personal guided experience working with me in laughter coaching or in my new program called The Principles of Laughter, which has uh, many videos and other resources you can explore at your leisure. So I'll link to the Principles of Laughter program in the comments below. And I look forward to seeing your comments about what you notice, what you just notice when you look within while you're laughing. What do you see that's simply there to be seen? Let me know in a comment below and I'll see you soon.